All right, what is going on guys? Today we are watching Call of the Night episode seven. In the last episode, we started out with what came on from the last episode, which was uh, Ko, Nazna and a client were messing about in the flat or the apartment. Um, Ko was doing his best as a first time masseuse and he ended up giving some really great advice, some okay massages probably, and a declaration that if, that, if the woman's life turned out not how she wanted it to be, then he would one day turn her into a vampire, which was technically a declaration to say that I'm going to make you fall in love with me. He doesn't care. Nazana flipped out, of course. Um, <clears throat> it was really funny. First half of the episode. And then the second half of the episode was more teasing uh, between Nazana and Ko. Um, and they went to kind of a night swim place, which looked really vibey. It looked pretty cool. Um, and then she, uh, on purpose, made him jealous, which was really cute. And they ended off uh, doing a kind of a lone swim together. Uh, and ended with a kiss, I believe. Was it a kiss? Or they sucked each other's blood? Or she sucked his blood. I don't know if she kissed him. Um, she may not have. But yeah, I'm very much looking forward to this episode. So as always, guys, like the video if you like the video. And subscribe to the channel if you are new. And let's go into this episode right now. Oh, it's quite early in the night. There's lots of people out. Oh, it's the woman. That was... Soon, I didn't think we were going to see her again. I legit did not think that we were going to see her so soon. She looks happier. She looks better as well. That's nice to be fair. She's got a good backup plan, so it relieves a little bit of stress. But that's okay. It also helped her too. Oh, it is fucking pouring. God damn. Rose always wearing the same clothes. But I guess so is Nazna. Oh, she's one of the girls in the in the intro. Where the flippin' hell did you come from? I was waiting to get her on. Gosh. I mean, some people like her. Damn. Bro keeps meeting people that are just out at night, trying to live life. Bro, if Nazuna wasn't al already, like, the main girl, I would think this is the main girl. I'd put her at like maybe 16, 17. In anime terms. Oh, damn, go. <laughs> He's proper staring at her. Oh, my God. I feel like this girl's going to make Nazana jealous. I'll buy him another one then. Where are you following her, Tuka? Oh, damn. What the fuck? Is this another vampire? Oh, shit! Fucking Attack on Titan level animation shit. What the fuck was that? Broken vampires reattach their limbs. But then again, Nazana could go for a wall, so... Bro, are we getting a vampire fight? Fuck yes. Oh, she is a completely different type of vampire. Oh my god. Oh, this is sick. Let's go. I was like, not expecting this kind of thing. Damn. Right, is this another vampire? Oh god. Bro, I saw, I mean, both of these girls were presumably in the intro. I remember the blonde girl. Didn't think there were going to be more vampires, though. Oh, another one. Oh, there's a few. I don't know which one I like more. 
It might be the tall one with the black hair. Oh, so like the red-headed one in the suit though, god damn. But I thought you can only be turned into a vampire if you fall in love. Niko, Midori, Hatsuka, Honda. <laughs> oh, fucking rejected. Damn. Or is the popularity shit going on with vampires? What the hell? Oh, so yeah, it is the same where he has to fall in love with them. I thought, like, Nazuna lied to him for a second there or something. Because <laughs> you flipping off. <laughs> oh, that's funny. You're the most like Nazuna chan. Oh, really? What does he mean by that? Oh, she's low key. Like, um. Like a racer head from My Hero. He's like a really well known hero, but he doesn't. Like, appear in crowds and shit. Oh, so they're probably all like. Idols and, uh, you know, CEOs and shit to make them popular. I was like, when is Nazanona gonna get there and bust heads? Why? Bro, Nazanona's a badass. Ooh. Bro, Ko is different. Damn, got her blushing. Oh, she doesn't know he, she means Ko. <laughs> They're all going off their tactics. Oh my god. God, she's playing into this kind of kitty cliche. The sleeves and shit. God. Bro, they're all so judgmental of each other. They're quite bitchy as well. <laughs> I'd laugh if he just flat out said nah. I'm not really interested in any of you. Please say no. I would piss myself. Please. <laughs> oh, Ko, I fucking love you, dude. Is it... Like, speaking to manga readers here, is it fair to say that Ko is aromantic or is really just does not understand at all the concept of liking someone yet? Which is fair. He's a child, you know. I feel like he knows Nazana's going to save him, so I think y'all guys need to chill on that. <laughs> Bro, they both got the wrong end of the stick. Oh, she hit the superhero landing. Let's go. She's adorable. <laughs> now they just want to hear the gossip. She has no plan at all. She's just going to be keep being herself. That's what he's going to fall for. Wait, I get the concept of how to turn someone into a vampire. That's what they mean by offspring, right? Or do they mean, like, actually have children? Oh, don't fuck with fucking Nazana. I wonder how you kill a vampire in this, uh, in this show. You just destroy the brain, or...? <laughs> Don't tell them that, they'll want to try it. Bro, shut them down, let's go. <laughs> Aww. Has he got a bat on his shirt, like Batman? That's so funny. Also like vampires, of course. Why does it matter to these guys if Nazana does whatever she wants of him? Like, who cares? I think it's quite romantic. One day she'll, like, suck his blood and he'll turn into a vampire. That's really cute. Aw, that's cute. What's going on? Bro, there's, like, something she's forgot to tell him or something, I swear. That freaking cliffhanger is going to be like, oh, you actually can only become a vampire when you're a young age or something like that. Oh, I don't know. I mean, the, the oldest one there was maybe the... Maybe the red-headed one. She was maybe, like, late 20s. I'm not sure. Um, Yeah, wow. Really good episode. Holy crap. I was not expecting that at all. The the action scene when she was... Uh, when Nazna came in and busted that girl's arm off. Holy shit. That was really cool. 
Um, was not expecting more vampires. I don't know. I, I mean, I saw all these girls in the uh, in the opening, of course, and it didn't occur to me. I mean, some of them are on screen, as you can see right down here. Um, it didn't occur to me that where are these all going to come from? They all look like different people, but I guess vampires. Yeah, makes sense. Wow, yeah, really good episode. I'm definitely excited to see more of this and uh, more characters being added to the show as well. It's really cool. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching this reaction and episode along with me. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out.